Hello, this is Sean and Ryan Studios. Hello. And, um, we recently got the new Kindle Fire 10s because... Seventh generation. The 6s are too old. Yeah, so we've always had these small 6, the small 6. But then we upgraded to the... the all new and bigger 10. I got the blue one. I got green. Blue and red. But this is not a comparison video. This is a video on how to transfer storage. Um, by storage, we don't mean like all storage. Just some games transfer, like things you sign into. Well, that's stuff you have to re-sign into. Yeah. But let's say you're trying to transfer your Minecraft worlds. This is the way to do it. Over the computer, it like, doesn't work. Yeah, we tried the computer. It just wouldn't access storage for the tens. So that's yeah, why... Yeah, we kept getting those messages. So that's why... Um, we made the, we're making this video. Yeah, because we found out a much better way. This is the best and most easy way. So, you so get, I already did the data transfer, but I can still show you. You get your 10. Here, Sean, you type in the app name on the ten, 6. I'll do it on mine. Okay. If you, All right. If you have, when you have, I'm when you have the 10, uh, it's a little bit hard doing it with one hand. When you have the 10, and then you have the Oh, so the old one six, loaded quickly. They're both uh, pretty different. Different. Wait, sizes. how does that one have full bars? All right. So you come up with all these different file transferring apps. But this is the one you want to get, the first one. Though, if you want to do it on iPad, you have to pay. Well, yeah. it's not popping up on this one, so I'll show you. No, where is it? I don't know. I'll see. All right, so do this app called File Transfer. Right here. And then, so what you want to do is download it. You want to download it on both things. On both devices. But remember, if you want data for a game, you have to already have data on your other device. So you can. So open then, here's it. what you want to do. We wanted to transfer from the old ones to the new ones. So then we looked. You want to select. And then to do Minecraft data, you have to go to games.com mojang. And then press and hold on all of these. Or to make it a lot easier, you could just hold on .com mojang and all of that will come up. Right. And then you have to press the transfer button. The, and then on the other one, you want to press that button. The, remember, the you arrow need, going down. Remember, you need Wi Fi to do this. And then you want to tap on this. I don't know if it'll say anything different. And then you gotta wait. Everyone hates waiting. You have to wait for all the. Oh darn it! I just turned it off. You... How do you do that? Uh -huh. Why do you just turn it off? Still uh, downloading that. I have to re-click on that. That was a dumb mistake. That's all the files you're downloading. I've had to download like thousands on my new one takes forever so yeah this is the easiest way to do it like yeah. and then it says there's an error but really there's not there's never an error and then you have to press the terminate button and boom you have all your new minecraft you have all your old minecraft worlds another thing you can do is just hold down every single file and all of your stuff will do it. Every single thing will come up. But remember, when you do this, you want to be sure that your bolts in if you go to like just if you just want your Minecraft worlds, you have to go to that file and enter the same thing Let's on see. both Kindles or else it'll transfer to the wrong thing. These old ones are way slower. And now, as you can see, hold on. I pressed I pressed this one first, and that one already loaded. I know loaded. they're a lot faster than the ones. I would recommend upgrading and using this tutorial. Well, it was already Prime Day. Yeah, you're like fifty dollars off. All right, so press play. 
Right. I deleted this world off my new one, but see, the world's see? on both Kindles now. Okay, so... Hey, what happened to this one? That's to transfer the data. It, I don't know. I think the picture's already transferred. They do. You want to go in the same account. If you want, like, all your pictures and stuff to download without doing this, you just have to go on the same accounts when you set this one up. Remember, file transfer. If it gets three stars, though, it's good. But if you want to do it on an iPad or an Apple product, it's $2 for the app. I don't know why it's free on oh, here. I, I'd pay for it. Yeah, it's worth it. So anyways, we hope you watch this guide, and if you do, I hope it's helpful. Okay, thank you so much for watching. We hope you are successful in doing this. Bye.